You are looking live at Memorial Stadium in Lincoln, Nebraska. One of the grand stages in all of college football. It's the number one USC Trojans and the number 14 Nebraska Cornhuskers on Saturday Night Football. Yeah, <laughs> there's no doubt about that. He has a lot of fun as the head coach at USC. David Beeler with the ball on the tee. He's from Anaheim. He'll kick it off. Andre Jones and Courtney Grixby are back deep for the Huskers. Short and high. Fielded on the run at the 19-yard line. There's an alley, a crease to the 34 for Andre Jones. Got Terrell Thomas at cornerback and Taylor Mays at safety. Keller's first pass is for a first down to the 49-yard line. Have a second chance back at him. He's waited a long time for this. Downhill in the second half. Four of his five That's picks right. came in there. But now after the first down, flashes out to the side. His second completed pass. And that's good for about four yards that time. The what a soccer. And we're going to be talking about that throughout the evening. Here is third down. Sack taken down. The Trojans mount that attack up front. There was no smash mouth football formation. And he does use the fullback right straight ahead who breaks into the clear. 25, 30, 35, across midfield, ridden down at the 45-yard line. And Bowman may have saved the touchdown. That is a behind John David Booty and play on is the signal here. A first down at the 47-yard line for the Trojans, their opening series. Bring end around motion, and here's Gable. He slips the first tackle, open field, 25. And he is to the five-yard line. And Kirk, I got to go back to tackling practice. That's a 40-yard. The black shots, the black shirts are in trouble here. There's the throw, touchdown, just like that. John David Booty on a strike. That was Avili, the fullback, and that is his game. Four plays. Whoa. 90. Glenn, the junior from Rust, Texas, stays in that backfield. Middle. Got the first down. So another well called play, and number 30 Fuchs can only stand and watch here tonight. Tried to blitz him, got picked up, got one on one beautiful grab at the 40 yard line. Keller gets it done that time. Sam Keller and the Cornhuskers. There's a shovel pass, knocked free by the Trojans. Picked up. Oh, this has got to come back. It's an incomplete yeah, pass, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Clay Matthews, but he dashes on into the end zone, but it's an incomplete Ball pass. shovel pass. Incomplete. incomplete. Fourth down. Yeah, the referee was looking over. That's Davis in motion. Booty from the end zone being pursued and throws it away. So the Trojans this time, they are sticking with the bigger back. Guy is man again. First down to the 36 yard line, and there is Purify. Glenn is lined up behind Keller. Two tight ends, quick slant, and there is Big Purify again inside the 30 yard line. And let's check in down below with Lisa. Loving a bit, and right now that's what Bill Callahan has done. Ellis is matched against Byford. Keller gets time. Another slant pattern to the 11-yard line. Nate Swift, the junior from Minnesota. Swift is to the left of the formation. Keller goes back to none inside the five-yard line. And there's the first reception by the senior. Tell right straight ahead if it's really old school. <laughs> Where's Tommy Frazier? Said he's handing it off. Got a touchdown. Cody Glenn, the junior from Rusk, Texas. Mike Keller is happy and tie the score, especially Brent the way they did it. USC was pinned inside their own five yard line, four plays, they went right down. Ten is on the field now for the Trojans. John David had plenty of time and he goes to the sideline and David Osbury who caught five passes against Idaho. He was in motion that time, now he'll catch his first ball of the night, slips the tackle, cuts back to the inside and that's what he brings to the attack. A first and ten. Teed. 
in the backfield. John David throws a perfect strike there for the first down. Far side reception by third down now and nine for the Trojans. Booty again with time and a drop. Incomplete is a call as Patrick Turner. It would have been a sensational grab. He hears it, he repeats it to the guys in the huddle, and then he tries to visualize it on a chalkboard. I'm glad you could remember at least. <laughs> Coming in underneath for the first and ten. That man was wide open to the 39-yard line. Erickson stays on the field to the right. Quick hitch to Purify, and Purify picks up a quick five on a soft corner that time. Play, and that's exactly what Cedric Ellis did right there. And Keller and the Cornhuskers need eight yards to move the chains on this one. Hit on the release, got it off in time. A gutty throw to Swift under pressure. Keller knew he was going to try to get the ball over the middle if you can. Instead, they're going to run the delay and not get it. For, a, for a, a, an offensive coach and Bill Callahan, who's been so... Yarder, behind the goalpost, here it comes. Going to bring it right in on you. Nebraska leads for the first time tonight. About USC, folks, they have not been unbeatable on the road. They've lost two of their last three road games. Corvallis and the Rose Bowl. And here they are in Lincoln. Canale to the five-yard line, and Joseph. Joseph. Coach and scoop it out. 35 40. They get a great break to the 45 yard line. The ball was picked. And he'll try to drive the Trojans to a go ahead score here if he can. Gable is his running back. Turner's off to his right. Gable with a hole in the middle, breaks free. And he has stopped at the 30 yard line. Zach Potter approaches in this set. Fullback in, tough play. Gable looking daylight again. And he's inside the 20 yard line. That's another first and 10 for the Trojan. On a cutback block, here is Stefan Johnson. Johnson gives him a burst, and it'll be first down and goal. Still on. Havili is the fullback, set right in front of him. Havili straight ahead for a touchdown. They go to the up back, and he busts into the end zone. So he's caught a touchdown pass, and now he's get on the field. And here's Beeler for the extra point. And that's right down O Street down here in Lincoln, folks. Keller on a short drop, incomplete. He was under pressure that time, trying to hit Sean Hill. By Bowman defensively. Second down. Here is the handoff, spin move by Johnson. And this bull's close to that first down. Try Johnson again, got the first down. Octavian brings him down at the 41 yard line. We get word that Bowman made his two backs. Here comes Johnson, got a big gaping hole, runs to daylight, 35. Brought down around the 25 yard line. The Trojans threatening the defense needs to stop here. Pump fake from John David, got time, back to the left side. And complete to the 20-yard line that time. And so, Avila is set right in front of Johnson. Here's Johnson. Big hole in the middle. And, Kirk, they found something here with Stefan Johnson. He looks to be the best. They come back. Big hole. Touchdown. He walks in. They sent motion. The middle opened up. Christopher O'Dowd, the center, you pointed it out, along with Rachel and Bob. Paul Johnson likes those holes, doesn't he? He sure does. And Beeler tacks on the extra point. They were stymied on third down in the second quarter. So here they are facing another one. Keller side steps away. Can he run for the first down? Going to drop it off. Complete. He's got his running back out of the backfield, Glenn. And that's a first and from the USC linebackers. And he gets back up, and he's ready for the next play. Snapping close to midfield, deflected in the air, 
intercepted on the deflection. Picked off by Terrell Thomas, the senior linebacker. Number 28 on the deflected pass. The first turnover of the 13 is back in. He'll be the tailback. Osbury's the motion man, and here comes Stefan again. Same gaping hole, and he busts inside the 15-yard line. We can't say it'll be here. That's Turner, number one in motion. Booty rockets out that way, and underneath to his tight Davis rumbles. Inside the five-yard line, Fred Davis, the senior from... Perfectly. Play action, Booty rolls, throws for the DZ, touchdown. Comes over to Anthony McCoy, number 86, a sophomore tight end from Fresno, California. And Young, the bootleg action, sometimes they'd give it on the zone, other times they'd pull it out and throw it to the backside off the naked. Beeler, second down at 14, intercepted. The second pick. And out of bounds at the one yard line Kyle Moore just snapped that one out of the air and suddenly things are backing up for the Cornhuskers well this is a zone blitz this is confusion this is peak and Washington dives across the end line end zone touchdown USC people could talk all they want about well, they didn't pass the ball enough tonight. Where are those wide receivers? Where's really good news? Here's what the coach wanted to hear. Vincent Joseph is fine. He's moving, talking. The report by Cedric Ellis, the nose man, 49, being doubled on this play. Incomplete. So it'll be fourth down and short. Sean Hill couldn't quite hang on. <laughs> Teams that look like they're not going to lose always seem to find a way to lose. There's, oh, Stefan bust free again. They have found their number one running back here tonight. Inside the hot preps, Christopher O'Dowd. Here's a play fake. Standing tall. Complete to the 17-yard line. Time they get ready for conference play. The true freshman out of Michigan. He's their future, I think, this year. Washington cuts in zone, battles, and he's just short of it down at the two-yard line. Speaking of freshmen. Nebraska's defensive front this year once they get to the Big 12. Washington Shirai back. He's got it. Stretches. In zone. Touchdown, USC. Strikes again. Well, on their last five possessions. On David Booty. Tack on the extra point. We got to have a little Saturday night soundtrack coming up from now. Keller. He was short of the first down. Nice catch going. Just dominating the top four in Nebraska. There's the swing, spin by the freshman, fumble picked up by the Corn Huskers to the 33 yard line. McEwen, Corey McEwen, number 13. Picking up Keller and the Cornhuskers. Don't do anything with the turnover. Drop it off now to Glenn. Three Trojans. Smacking down at the basket. Picked up some yardage. Oh. On the slant. Pushed out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. Cody Glenn, the junior from third and 11 as we begin our countdown to number one. Complete. Just short of the end zone, down at the one yard line. That is a first and 10, a big game. Brian Cushing, the injured linebacker, checks in just in time on that play as Nebraska bucks in for a touchdown. Cody Glenn, number 34. Alex Henry, redshirt freshman from Omaha. Tacks on the extra point job of controlling that line this has got to be a huge disappointment for Kevin Cosgrove as to how uh, the defensive front has played what a strike what a throw that was pitch and catch to David Osbury these receivers with booty Andre Jones is the corner on that play there's a play fake standing tall and spinning back 
and making a grab at the 33 uh, yard line and uh, school he stayed right there and uh, short drop wide open that's a first down for the Trojans and using the tight end Fred's is seated still higher. Hold, he okay. won six races okay. so he's seated number one he has a he has a point lead on Jeff Gordon complete and uh, swinging back out of the backfield Fred whether they've run or what did they throw now they bring it back down dives for the pylon and touchdown Bradford so Allen Bradford the sophomore USC comes into Lincoln and they've hung 49 last week uh, this defensive front there's none getting into the action and that'll be people said oh no matter what happens not, I'm not so sure of that and uh, I want to take it take a look at the schedule because there's uh, lucky in underneath not short of a first down but uh, no. so now you now you're you're down a couple games so that that is a huge game in the Big 12 North and Peterson again so Todd Peterson he's a graduate Different style of players that's a big that? change with the <laughs> sports isn't it? that's right complete Peterson end zone bus touchdown Todd Peterson brings him down the field 20 yards for the score and he caught three big passes on it Keller back in the shotgun a great time and drills it in there he drilled a strike for that one that's Sean Hill Hazelton and Ronald Johnson can they be the receivers that they're used to having at SC you know, not gonna let Sanchez air it out they just hand it off to Bradford and uh, bring up fourth down and uh, Pete Carroll at 49 that's not too bad by a guy who's on base 6'4 230 pounds oh Kirk big time player here's lucky diving for the uh, pin on the spot might be a little bit shorter where they uh, Tom Osborne didn't throw it 53 times in a month in a season maybe <laughs> <laughs> there's a first down lucky and incidentally and of course tonight we began the countdown Peterson sprinting in zone touchdown again that's his second of the night that's 18 yards I've just been impressed that Nebraska has got a man open didn't pick him up early and uh, then threw a little bit high great your birthday huh picked it up handed it back off lost the yardage that time That'll do it. 49-31. Trojans prevail.